guys welcome to another vlogmas video it's Sherelle if you haven't already please subscribe below and welcome to another video so I just wanted to show you guys what I have for my living area and then put up my tree but not decorate my tree but put it up today and let me turn the camera on do, 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 do. so this is everything that I have like that I bought so far for like the living area so hopefully um i don't have to do that mo much more shopping i really just need a topper for my tree and what's it called and a skirt so i just wanted to show you guys what i have so far and then i'm gonna put up my tree so first up since it's right here i have two of these pre-lit wreaths I have no clue where I'm gonna put these y'all. This is when I just was buying just to buy. But I got it on sale um, at Walmart. It was like half price, so it was like $5. But they pre-lit and hopefully I could find somewhere to put these. <laughs> See, here's the, uh, here's the other one. So I was thinking about putting them like on the side of my tree for the living room but when I'm gonna put the tree I have those two paintings and I don't want to take those paintings down so I don't know if I should put it like above the tree I mean above the paintings I know a lot of people have put their reefs like on their paintings but this is just too big to put on the painting so I don't know I still have to decide where I want to put these then I got these mini trees. These was also on sale for um, $5 at Walmart. The original price was $9.98. So I'm definitely going to put one of these in our room since we don't have a, any decor in our room. But this is pre-lit as well. So then I'll just fluff it out. And I think I'm going to put it like on our dressers. I have two. I do want to put one of these at the bar. So... I'm going to put one of these at the bar and then put the other one in our room. I wish I should have thought about it because I could have put two of these on our nightstands, which would be perfect. But I only have two. So then I'm going to put it, put one by the bar. And if the bar doesn't work out, I'll just put them in our room. Here. <laughs> so this is how it looks. Don't mind. Oh. So this is how it looks. So both trees. So this is a rookie that my aunt made ooh, probably years, years ago. I'm gonna put this on our door. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna put it on our front door or our back door, but I'm definitely gonna put it on the door. Oh, don't wanna break that. Okay, what's in here? These risers from the dollar section are the bullseye section in Target. Definitely going to use these to decorate like the island and probably buy the um, the bar too, but I'm not sure. Got two of these. Got two of these Christmas trees. I don't know what to do with them yet. I need to go back to Target and get some more. I do want red and white ones, so hopefully they have more. I'm not going to Target this week because it's Thanksgiving week and I know it's going to be hectic. So I just plan on going to Target after I come back from my trip. So yeah, hopefully I'm, I'm prepared, but I'm not prepared at the same time because I have been new Christmas was coming and I should have got more of these because these are so cute. I, I even put them on my floating shelves. In my entryway too. Okay, I got these mini ornaments for the mini trees. I'm out beam is white and red, of course. And I'm gonna definitely put these on. Um, I probably won't yeah, I probably use eight and eight because they're 16. Or I probably just don't put any ornaments on the tree that's going in our room because nobody's gonna see that but us. So yeah. 
And I think that's it for this box. So I got a deal on these. The glitter is gonna be everywhere. I don't know why I was glitter crazy. Josh was like, why everything is so glittery? I don't know. But the, these ornaments, so they're different designs. They have red. Of course, you can see the glitter. So let's see. Like some of them have like different stuffings in them. So this one looks like it got like tissue, like glittery tissue. This one has little red beads. So there are different sizes too, which I like. This one just has glitter in it. And I love the design on this one. Like it's glitter, but it's like, it's a different design. And then I think lastly, it's like this design on the big ones. So I think that'll be cute because just want to keep with the red theme, but not go like solid red. And I want to keep with the little glitter too. I have glitter everywhere. <laughs> That's the only thing. <laughs> Next up. Um, yeah, I probably saw this in a previous vlog. I got this peppermint pillow from Ross. I haven't been back to Ross since, so I'm pretty sure they got newer stuff in, but I feel like this will go cute on our sofa. And I also got these decor pillows as well. I don't think they're Christmas. They're just regular red pillows, but I feel like give a little pop of color in our house. So last year I did the black and white, try to go with the aesthetics, and this year... I want to do more traditional, so I want to do the white and the white and red candy cane, you know, theme. I'm trying to leave out the green, but yeah, most of the stuff I bought is like white and red. So Hobby Lobby has been so clutch, and I should have went back when it was sixty percent, but I haven't been back um, lately. But I'm pretty sure because every time I was in there, they had boxes on boxes on boxes in the aisles. Like, they haven't unpacked, like, anything. So, I'm pretty sure they packed most of this stuff now. So, that was, like, a couple of weeks ago. But I fell in love with these. So, they had bigger ones at, um, what's it called? At Hobby Lobby. So, same design as this one. And they had bigger ones, but I don't think big ones will look right on my tree because... Like I said, my tree's not huge. And I was going to go out and buy a new tree, but I'm going to wait till next year. I'm seeing all the trees on sale now, and it's so tempting. But I'm going to be responsible and wait till next year for another tree. Because I already bought a new tree <laughs> for this year, and I should have just... Well, I couldn't pass up a $15 tree. So... Just want to open up one so you guys can see how they look. They're very lightweight, so they're foam. So of course they shatterproof. They will not. They will not break. So it's not glass. It's foam. And get closer for you to see. Yes. They're so cute to me. So I got a couple of those. And then for the ribbon. So this ribbon is huge. I haven't realized it. But I think instead of like wrapping it around the tree, since the tree's not that big, I'm going to try to do like two like strands going down, like draping down the tree. So this is, an, it goes with the black and, um, the black. I want to do black and white so bad, but I, I have to commit. <laughs> so it goes with the white and red theme I'm going with. So cute. I bought two of these, so I'm pretty sure this is more than enough, but we're going to see how it drapes down. I don't want to cut it because it's just going to mess up the design, but I feel like it's so cute. And more from Hobby Lobby. These are little things you stick in a tree. So, like, once I put the ornaments and stuff, I don't think I'm going to, like, max it out with the ornaments. But once I put the ornaments and stuff, I'm going to use, like, things like this to put, like, you know, tree fillers to have it stick out. Give it a little dimension. I just have a triangle shape tree. 
I just love these. These are so cute. The little candy canes. So when they stick out the tree, they'll be like this. I'm going to try to keep it for when the ribbon could point out like this. So let me show you. So the ribbon could be on this side. But these are so cute. I feel like it's going to give my tree a lot of dimension. And it still has like the sparkly detail that also matches this. And I'm not a glitz and glamour girl, but I am this year. <laughs> and of course, stuff with more glitter. So I feel like this is so cute. I feel like I'm gonna put these like on the top of the tree. Like, I don't even know how my top of my tree could look because I haven't found a topper that I like yet. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna do an angel. I don't know if I'm gonna do a star. I've been looking throughout the stores and nothing popped my mind. So I don't know if I'm going to actually do a topper this year. If I find one, I find one. Hopefully by the time I decorate my tree. But I feel like this will go cute on the top of the tree as well. I bought, I think, four of them. And I could just have them around the, the top if I don't have a topper. But I want a topper. I want a star. I want something on the top of the tree. It's like the last little piece that you need to finish off decking the tree. So... Lastly, a continuation from Hobby Lobby. So last time I went to Hobby Lobby, I bought some more of these. So I think I have more than enough. <laughs> so I think I have four. Yeah, I think I have more than enough of these ornaments for sure. But these, these are these are so cute. They're huge. Look, they're like the side of, size of my head. So, my thing is, it's like, I'm not going to use a lot of these because I don't want to clutter my tree. So, I only bought two packs. And I think two packs is way too, too many. But I don't want to clutter the tree. So, hopefully it works out. Hopefully my vision comes through. But I feel like it's cute and it stays with theme. And when I went last time, I didn't know I bought these already. <laughs> This is, this is sad when you're shopping. So I bought more of these the last time I went to Hobby Lobby, which is wild to me. That I bought, but I feel like these are cute and you can never have enough of them. So. And then. To add more white to my tree. I bought. I don't even know what to call them. I guess like little white berries so i bought these these are very glittery i'm not gonna shake them that much i'm not gonna even move them i am gonna spread them out once i put them in a tree but i'm gonna save the glitter for that because it's too much i did buy a couple of those just to have them stick out the tree all right y'all so i'm gonna show you why i'm putting my tree up I, i'm actually gonna put the tree up today but i'm not gonna decorate it today that's probably be after Thanksgiving for sure. But I'm gonna put the tree up today, clean up my little my little area, vacuum it, and then yeah, you guys get to see me put up my pre-lit tree. So I don't have to worry about lights this tree, thank God. But my pre-lit tree in my living room. Now this is the same height as my other tree, I think. Then my other tree is six six point five two, and this one is six point five. So my idea was getting a tree, like, I don't know, it's not this type of material. Like, I was going to get like a real looking tree with the real um, leaves and branches. That was my idea to do that th this year, but I'm going to hold off this year because... I'm, at this point, I'm just being greedy and I'm going to have three trees for what? <laughs> you know, it's just me being greedy and that's not the reason for the season, if you know what I mean. So, yeah, let me go put up this tree and I'm going to show you guys what I'm putting it up at. So this is what I'm currently putting my tree like in the middle right here. The lighting is so horrible. It's been rainy and dark all day, so don't mind that but i'm gonna move this and put this elsewhere i'm definitely gonna move my wallflower and probably put it in this um 
this plug because I need this plug to plug up the tree. But yeah, let's get to it. tree it's a 6.5 foot pre-lit madison pine tree with clear lights walmart Charlie Brown right now. Even my other tree was way fuller than this when I put it up. It's giving Charlie Brown. It's giving Charlie Brown to me right now. <laughs> Look at it. It's, this is 6.5. I'm only 5'3, so I don't know. They come this little, I guess they come this little inch right here. See, this is why I wanted another tree. But I'm grateful. I'm grateful. I'm grateful. I, I'll be. Able, I was able to afford two trees. So, yes. Let's not be too picky, Cheryl. But it's giving Charlie Brown right now. I don't know if I should start at the bottom. And I'm gonna start at the top this time just to see what to do.
so this is how it's looking so far i haven't fluffed it out to fully to my liking so just the next couple of days i probably just be fiddling with it messing with it maneuvering it to my liking but it came out a little bit fuller than i thought it would be so of course like places that have like the holes and stuff i will try to cover up with ornaments but then it's not that bad for 15 dollars so and to think i was gonna just not use it and just buy another one even though i do want one with not the, the of course the trees are fake but like better looking leaves than this but other than that it does its job i just want to shape it up a little bit more as you can see like this part is just like sticking out for no reason so i do have to like shape it a little bit better but yeah i did fluff it out as much as i can and to see the light now this one is just a white one um you can't change the color of lights on this one or you can't change like if if it flashes or anything it's just a solid white so i do have to unplug it but other than that i'm cool with it now this is going to be doing like all week probably you see how this like randomly got like a hole i don't know like i just have to fixed its flaws but don't mind the trash i'm gonna clean that up but this is how this looks so i'm thinking like a white skirt so i just need to find like a white skirt i wanted to do a tree collar but i don't think i want to do that anymore um they had like felt ones at target i think i saw and it just looks too cheap to me so i think i'm gonna do like Either find like a cute white blanket or just a regular like tree skirt. But I want it to just be white since the tree is going to have a whole lot of red in it. And like I said, those pictures early, those wreaths earlier, I don't know if I want to hang them like above these pictures. I don't know, but I don't want to hang them on the pictures at all. So yeah, that's a no, no. But yeah, here's the tree. I'm excited. I can't wait to show you guys how I'll decorate it. Of course, that'll be in this series, this Vlogmas series. Thank you for watching today's Vlogmas vlog. I'm so excited. The tree came out better than I expected. It was looking kind of rocky. It was looking Charlie Brownish when I first took it out of the box. Y'all know it. It, it was looking very Charlie Brownish, but I think I know what to do with it. I think I'm gonna shape it up a little bit. And of course, when I decorate it, it'll just look more full. My goal is to cover up all like the whole spots with um, ornaments, ribbons, the little trinkets that I have to stick in a tree or whatever. But yeah, so don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys tomorrow in the next vlog. Bye.